New developments in the collapse of this 17-year-old girl on the volleyball court. She's telling us about the symptoms she showed before going into cardiac arrest. Channel 2's Craig Lucy joins us now live from the newsroom. And Craig, several doctors did not catch a heart problem with this girl. Jovita, she said, Claire Crawford said that she had some shoulder pain. She had shoulder surgery, but the burning sensation continued. Again, she had surgery for that, but nothing really pointed to a possible heart attack. Thankfully, they had an AED just like this one on campus, and this is what saved her life. As soon as 17-year-old Claire Crawford falls back, staff and coaches rush to her side. See the academic dean at Loganville Christian Academy sprint to the defibrillator. Took the AED back. Uh, quickly opened it up, turned it on, got the pads on her. Then you can see Claire's body jolt. And I woke up and she was in my face and everybody was yelling. Or it felt like they were yelling, but apparently they weren't. Crawford had a heart attack and she and her parents have no idea why. I have no medical history. My wife doesn't have any medical history in their families that would cause this. So, I mean, you just, you just don't know. Like burning kind of, but like down my arm, down my left arm and in my chest. Like my heart felt like it was working really hard, which it was. Claire Crawford had gone to multiple doctors prior to this game. She even had shoulder surgery at one point, and it's still unclear as to why she went into cardiac arrest. They were going to go in and put an implantable cardio defibrillator in because they weren't really sure. They weren't finding anything that caused her to go into cardiac arrest. What's clear now is the importance of this AED and Children's Health Care of Atlanta is promoting the Project Save Drill trying to prepare everyone should a student or teacher go into sudden cardiac arrest. It's great that they were all trained and I'm glad that if it happened to somebody else they would be trained to help them as well. Crawford's doctors found some unexplained blockages, so they went ahead and did a triple bypass surgery. Also, the, their, her parents really could not stress the importance of having an AED around when students are out there competing, especially when students are competing on the road. Live in the newsroom, Craig Lucy, Channel 2 Action News. Certainly something to think about, Craig. Thank you.